Hi fam. Here's the comparison and brief update for day 9 par 3 progression. I went from total levels 977 to 1274. I am still trying to get to base level 30. My three lowest skills are 42 slayer, 29 smithing and 28 fishing. My three highest skills are 70 strength, 73 fletching and 82 woodcutting. Previously I contemplated about getting a Skarnir for my third but seeing as my first and second areas are Z and Desert which will be quite the grind, it may be a mistake to take a Skarnir and triple the amount of grind. And my path to Armadil armor might be tedious as I have no access to red or black gin compass. So I thought about picking Mauritania instead for Carol's armor, Slayer helmet and Sarv amulet which will boost my DPS by a lot and be much better than just full black dyed with rune crossbow and diamond bolts without gin compass. But then I really dislike Mauritania, and I regret picking it in the previous leagues as my first choice because TOB and Nightmare can be quite difficult since I am going range build instead of melee as Mauritania is a melee heavy area. Then I go through my research and data again to find the best third area for my range build and relic path for this league. I have come to the conclusion that I want an easy area to make my league life smooth sailing and more fun. After much thinking, I would rank Turan 1, Wilderness, for Menic as 3rd place, Asgarnia, Mauritania as 2 ND place and Kandarin as the 1st place winner for my 3rd area pick. Since I already have great skilling and combat content and everything, I needed from Z and Desert which will make League chill as Duck and Kandarin is just a great addition to my gameplay. Here's why you should pick Kandarin over Asgarnia and Mauritania. Kandarin has great slayer mobs like Kraken, Demonic Gorillas, Thermoenuclear Smoke Devils, Chaos Druids for the Drugs and Herbs, Warped Creatures for Warped Scepter. Great mage weapons like Iban, Tridents of Sea, Abyssal Tentacle, Heavy Ballister, Onyx Jewelries, Anguish, Fury, Torture, Occult, Suffering, Tormented. Fun group content like Barbarian Assault and Castle War. Ardub Night Thieving, tons of farming patches, two agility courses, Afk Barbarian Fishing for Agility, tons of hunter activities. Also Kandarin has hard diary rewards include 10% increase to the activation chance for the special effect from enchanted bolts, even in PvP. This bonus stacks additively with other bonuses like the Armadil Crossbow special attack. Minigame points received are increased by 8x by tier 7 relic unlocked and thus make Barbarian Assault bearable and quick. This way I get less stress and don't have to consume a lot of time to grind and do long hours of bossing forward slash raids. What I would do differently if I can restart League 4. So far, I have enjoyed and liked my area choices and relic path, but I regret not picking Kandarin for my second pick instead of Desert. I regret grinding rock golems for rune pickaxe and grinding barbarians in Z4 amulet and ring molds because not only did I not get the loot, but I also wasted hours. Yeah that's all folks. Enjoy my garter gameplay. See you next time for part 4.